Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are making eucalyptus experiment. Normally this is a short soap, but I made it a high top. So anyway, let's go make some soap. Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're making eucalyptus spearmint. Um, it's a fave. It is a fave. <laughs> it's a spearmint. It is a fave. If you're new to soap making, this is a good one to start your line with. Here are my oils, my clay, my cream, and oatmeal. I'll be using a celestial silver and alpine green, some blue jojoba beads, and some green jojoba beads, and titanium dioxide. Okay, so let's get started. In my lye solution, there's tests of silk, sodium hydroxide, sodium lactate. And Allo. Okay, it's my first time making it this year. It's going to be a high top. Yeah. Okay, and in this one we're going to put some jojoba beads. These ones are um, Brambleberry, Sierra Sky. They're not around anymore. They, they were discontinued. I'm not happy about that. Because now, the ones I found, I have some from Cup Choice. But they're, they're not like a teal color, they're like a bright blue. And I like the teal. These are the Lagoon Green from Crafters Choice. Alpine green. And this is the celestial silver, which is blue. It's a pretty, pretty blue, though. I think all blues are pretty. So. Yeah. Let me get these buzzed up.
I will be doing an in the pot swirl with these. Make sure that colors are good and mixed. I do love the smell of this. I uh, had gotten sick of it for a long time because it was really overplayed. Like lavender still is. <laughs> but you know, it's not ordered as often anymore. I mean, the soap is, but I mean, you know, it's not overplayed in soaps and I mean, bath bombs, lotions, candles, every single thing you can think of. About, I think in 2018, uh, Eucalyptus Experiment was like, maybe it's 2017. It was like my best seller in literally everything. Soap, bath bomb, you name it. But that died down. Now, the soap is still a best seller. But. I usually make it a short top, but I decided I don't want to. I like my high tops. So, this is a new design for Eco Experiment. Even though well, a lot of my customers that love this are men. Although it's a very, very, very unisex fragrance, I'm sure most of you know what that fragrance smells like. It's going to be an easy pour. And then we will come back for the piping. So I'll see you on the flip side. Hi guys, welcome back. We're going to pipe you good experiment. Oops, I didn't spray it. Okay, keep your tops from falling off. <laughs> I've had that happen before. Not pleasant. You know, sometimes it takes forever for the soap to set up, but yet your soap in your dish, in your box, in your mold sets up much quicker. But anyway, this is actually just about the perfect consistency for piping. It's got to be a first today. Today was not a good day for piping. This one will not have any embeds. So i got to get the piping right, you know? Because there's nothing to hide it. <laughs> So now we're just going to throw some glitter on there. I'm going to do the Mystic Blue. Do we get any closer for you? No, I good? think we're good. Okay. Just about ready for you guys just to get a close up. Woo! Purdy, purdy, purdy. Oop, I missed some. But it's okay. Where? Right over there inside. I mean, not every single thing has to be covered in glitter. <laughs> yeah, you do like it. I like glitter. Woohoo! Alright, guys, now it's time for the close up.
guys, welcome back. We're going to cut the eucalyptus spearmint soap. Just taking the end off. It's pretty inside though. It smells good. Pretty swirls. If you're interested in purchasing any of our Bath and Body products, the links are in the description box below. If you would like to follow us on social media, those links are also in the description box below. What's the problem? Nothing, my love. Everything looks pretty, pretty, pretty. Okay. He was doing some kind of hand gesture. I don't, <laughs> I don't know what he was doing. Hand gesture that threw me off. I don't know. I don't remember what I was saying. We usually do a low top, right? Yeah, usually eucalyptus is a low top, but it's going to be a high top from now on. Gotta do it justice, baby. Huh. I just don't enjoy making low tops. I don't like the way they look. Whoever buys them from us, got a little step up. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of people buy the Eucalypt Experiment. It's a bestseller. I don't think that'll change just because it got high top. Nah. I think they'll enjoy more. And there's a whole beads in here, so some light exfoliation. Very cool. I do like the color. Did a really good job, Thanks, honey. The colors haven't changed. They're the same colors they've always been. I know, just, it's just really pretty. Oh. Yeah. It's like a marble, marble look. Yeah, I like the swirls. This kind of like marble. I don't even remember what pour I did with this. I think it was an in the pot. Yeah, I, in the pot, right? You guys are remembering because you guys just saw it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're getting down to the end here. This is our final cut. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great day. Bye. Go get you some. <laughs>